I'm Mike, product manager at Plastomatic Valves, here to talk to you about an economical option to control flow in your liquid piping system. Uh, most of the time we see ball valves like this for a block and vent or shut off application with a full port ball. But we could also use them as an economical option to control flow. You'll see here some standard options, a linear flow control and an angled ball ranging from 15 to 90 degrees. Plastomatic also offers customization based on any application. So feel free to call our technical department. Our engineers will work with you based on your flow and pressure parameters. We could design you a custom ball, as you can see here, for any application. We could then pair a characterized ball in our ball valve with an electric actuator for unparalleled flow control in your system. So in your system, say you want to dose a chemical or whatever it may be, maybe drain, keep a tank level between two certain um, you know, upper and lower limits, you could have your PID system, your PLC, whatever it may be, uh, send readings to the actuator and the actuator will correspond and open or close to adjust those parameters to meet your system demands. We have some applications where tank level is very precise in ultra high purity, like semiconductor grade uh, tank level, where uh, we have cafe actuators essentially dithering uh, nonstop 24 seven uh, for hundreds of millions of cycles. Uh, all using a, this is a 60, sorry, this is a 90 degree ball. Um, we have a lot of success using characterized balls in conjunction with cafe actuators or actuators in general to really dial in specific flow applications. Dialing in on some of these custom balls you see here, this is just a series of holes drilled in. This customer had a very specific rate. They wanted the ball to be fully open and have a specific CV given their liquid uh, that they were using in their system. Then we move over to these two over here, you'll notice they don't have any holes at all. These, both of these balls were used with an electric actuator and had very specific low flow demand. With a ball like this, with these holes, you will get an interruption and your electric actuator will not be able to pick up in between those points. You essentially have a dead zone. So we are able to, using precision machining, dial in a slot that will allow uninterrupted flow that will be characterized you know, according to the customer's flow curve that's requested. So you may have a tank with two level sensors, you know, upper limit, lower limit, and when it's getting further away or close to the top, it'll send a signal to the actuator to either open or close. So a linear flow ball, essentially what it will do is as you turn the handle towards open, right, the 90 degree turn, your flow curve, if you were to graph it, will be exactly linear. So a lot of uh, different applications require um, so if you had a full port ball, this might be way too much flow when it might not be, um, you might not be able to dial it in as perfectly as you would like to. So using a characterized ball, the flow curve is just much more predictable, much more linear. So you're able to dial it in pretty much by degree open. You should expect this amount of flow. Back on the customized balls, we even have customers that request no holes, so no flow, and they could add their own customization. We've had customers that have wanted um, literally one 40,000th hole you know, ultra low flow. So really there's no application we haven't seen and we'd be glad to you know, design you a custom ball for your application. You can control flow or modulate flow with a full port ball. However, what you will find is you're gonna have difficulty dialing it into your specific requirements. So if you have a very tight tolerance on your flow demand, doing it with a full port ball is gonna be very difficult. Doing it with a characterized ball that has been tailored to your application is gonna be seamless. Second, all right. So on a linear flow ball, the benefit of that is you can get a predetermined flow rate based on your angle of opening using our flow graph here. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The benefit of using a linear flow ball is you can get a predetermined flow rate based on your angle of opening using our flow charts published on our website. So here at Plastomatic, we can customize a ball valve to meet any of your flow requirements.